Hi, welcome back to Bransford Webs. So we've had a lovely sunny weekend behind us, the weather's continuing to look good. Um, perfect garden weather really, sort of mid-teens, high-teens at times. Bit of sunshine mixed in there and a little bit of rain every now and then. So perfect to get the garden growing and um, people to get out there and work in the garden too. So with that um, good weather, stuff's really burst to life on the nursery. Loads of stuff come online for next week. Of course next week deliveries are in time for the bank holiday. Um, so we've been very careful with the stuff we've put on to make sure it's got bud on there, make sure it's got some flower on there and it's going to have some real impulse potential on the plant area. So with that said, we'll um, look at a few lines that we've made saleable for next week. So the first thing that's ready for next week is our second and last batch of Rissman Balls Mauve. So two litre bat, um, spec as was the first batch. Um, so these have actually grown the first tunnel behind me here with the um, skin on it. This Balls Mauve is in here, you may just see the um, bit of colour coming through. So a nice two litre crop, uh, say first sort of leader showing plenty of colour and loads of bud coming around it with a bit more colour showing and the purple pot really helps accentuate that um, mauve coloured flower. Something new on the um, looking good this week is this new salvia, so this is called Blue Marvel. Nice compact habit to it, but these lovely large flowers, you can see the buds are just coming out there, there's been masses of this deep sort of purpley blue colour um, by the time this hits garden centres next week. Also a nice compact plant is um, Campanula Viking, also new for this um, year, so again nice compact, loads of bud on there and these lovely um, bluey purple flowers too, a pale blue I'd really say on that, so again in a 2 litre spec. Something not as much colour on it but the bud's definitely in there is Lucantum Highland White Dream, um, so plenty of bud forming on there and this has come from nowhere, so last week this wasn't showing any um, sign of bud, it was sort of half the height, so it's growing like mad. So hopefully by the time this arrives in garden centres next week, that bud will have really swollen and um, be ready to burst into colour. So and in my opinion, Lucanthum Highland White Dream is the best Lucanthum of all of them. Um, really performs well in the garden. It's been around a long time, but it really does stand up well against all these new varieties in the garden. And then ever popular and a Chelsea favourite, with Chelsea just around the corner, so to bear this in mind, is um, an enemy wild swamp. So loads of bud in there, loads coming up through the crown as well. Good chunky two litre pot full, it's an overwintered crop. Um, so really does well and I say quite often features at Chelsea. So um, you get customers in the plant area asking for this one. And then a bit of a shrubby line, but a colourful shrubby line are potent tillers. Um, so we put online, I think we put five out of the seven online this morning. Um, all lovely two litre pot full, all outdoor grown, so they've been all out all winter, so they've nice and tight habits to them. Loaded in bud and flowers starting to show as well. And then back onto the herbaceous lines, so um, still be our unique series. So I've got five colours in this, all the way through some um, deep pink, all the way through to white. Um, lovely foliage to them as well, some of these, well, it's a lovely dark green foliage with a sort of burgundy tips to it as well. But again, two litre and just producing a nice bit of bud on there now and that's come up over the last week. So hopefully a bit of colour by next week. And then um, a couple of uh, sort of our impulse herbaceous lines are going online now. So this is Campania Tachyon, no it's not, yes Tachyon Blue, sorry. Thought it was white for a moment, so I've got white as well. Again, good two litre pot for loads and loads of bud on there. Outdoor grown, so you know it's tough and it's um, ready to go out over the bank holiday weekend. And then last but not least, um, really shows potential and um, just starting to open up in, this, in these sunny conditions, but our gazanias. So we've got a patch of Comanche Mohawk, so you've got a patch of the original one, the lovely sort of bicolour flower, yellow and orange, um, Comanche the variegated one and uh, Mohawk the um, yellow one, yellow flowered one. So a good mix in there, again two litre spec, nice chunky, and this will flower all the way through until October, November time now. So the right place in the garden or in a pop container, it's perfect for that. So I'm going to scoot quickly because I can hear lots of tractors whizzing around, the potting team are busy potting like mad, dispatch team are busy dispatching like mad, so it's a very busy nursery at the moment, so I'm going to get off and get out of their way. I'll see you next week. 